Yo you guys, what is going on? It's Blazing Your Kicks here. And this is way before the video starts. So you guys are going to see other stuff after this clip, but I just wanted to introduce something. My dad and I have been working on this whole space for months now. Like, we've moved in last August, and it's April now. We've been working on this garage for so long. From installing, like, new desks to pegboard to all this stuff. And I just want to say it's getting really close to finishing. If I could turn off the birds, I'd, like, turn them off. Anyway, the reason why there hasn't been many restoration or custom videos lately is because of this. And the people waiting for their restorations or customs, and who have been patiently waiting, thank you so much. You guys know who you are. All that good stuff. So thank you. I made sure I included extra gifts like laces, stuff like that for, you know, being late on the project. Not only that, the quality of the videos you guys are going to see is going to increase by a lot. I just wanted to show you guys this little rig my dad built right there. That will literally angle the camera down onto that workspace. And that's good because you guys are going to see an aerial view of what's going on. You're also going to see shots from the GoPro. I've learned how to use it really well. So even though I look like a dweeb, you guys won't be able to see it because you'll just see directly how I'm working on the sneaker up close and all that good stuff. And of course, I'm bringing you guys extra angles from this tripod right here. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video, and if you do, hit that like button, and let's just get right into it. Steam music, bitch, sing to it. This how you cook up some dope with no powder. Don't turn on that stove, just turn this shit up louder. Black Eddie Bauer, mask on my face like I'm ready to take what is yours, cause it's ours. Y'all stole my style, I shit on you like bowels and take all your princesses, bitch, I am Bowser. Yeah. Fuck superpowers, I got this weed. Gun on my head, dog, that's all that I need. I don't play games, man, I'm not in no Yo you guys, what is going on? It's Blazing Your Kicks here. And today in this video, it's gonna be a full, like a 100% full customization of these pairs right here. Uh, this is the 2015 Lazy, Lazy, Laney, Jesus Christ, Laser 5s. And I customize them into la Laser 5s. Customize these into la these are laser lane fudge. These are laser fours. They came out in 2015. And these are laser laney fours that came out in 2016 by me. Let's see if we can get this to 2,000 likes. If we can get to the 2,000 likes, that'd be awesome. And I'm just going to show you guys in depth this tutorial. So let's just get into it. Okay, guys. First thing I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be lining the top of the sneaker with just some tape. Now, for this step, you're going to want to take your midsole magic this is very strong you guys i highly recommend doing this in an open area and so yeah it's it's strong Okay guys, so I'm showing you this for a specific reason. When you are stripping your paint, you want to make sure that thing is completely gone. And to do that, I highly, highly recommend Raleigh Restoration's Mitzel Magic. Not only am I saying this because it saved my ass, but because it's a true product by a true seller. I What happened was, I thought I was all good. Uh, my knowledge was completely wrong. Um, I cut out the clips that you guys will probably never have seen. Uh, where I was just explaining some things that I thought at first. So I painted over it. I didn't like the texture. I completely said, you know, screw it. I'm going to redo the whole thing. I applied that on there. Took about probably 10 minutes. I got off all my mistakes and every single little piece of residue that was on there before. And don't worry, the shoe is not messed up at all. Like literally this blue right here that you see is just going to get covered. I didn't bother stripping it or anything like that. This. Look at this. Alright guys, so the next step we're going to be doing is we're going to be taking the Royal 5 
and just paint as you guys can see and we're just gonna be painting the midsoles pointed at me and see greatness pointed at me and see greatness they need a beans don't need all black mercedes tens don't need all white he races but homie i'm saying i need a penthouse that's vacant a rap money so i'ma lick him the beach is so wicked pick up your shot my bitch is a murderer she got a body she got that brain some are cum laude my city the jungle don't take that safari it's lions it's tigers gangs and disciples lords judas and shakes and them rifles whores who swear that they live by the bible when friends who think they deserve more Entitled, and that's why I say, I'm out of the ghetto, away from the mornings with snow and that shuffle. I'm out of this level, I'm trying to be number one. Why would I settle? Go to the new world, no Pinto, no Nino, no Santa Maria. Still keep it hooked with my peers, sipping Carlos Rossi Sangria. Dragging my cup, working my wrist, I be spanking my slut. Juggle my nuts, use your two hands while I juggle these fucks. But that zero, it's not my hands. Alright guys, the next step is to do these wing colors right here, and these are really simple. This part blue, and you're making this part yellow. So, that should be pretty easy. My hands busy holding middle fingers up. I don't do two things, I love in this trust. And I don't hate y'all, I'm just fucking with us. And that's where the nipsy, my hustles mean I can sell best to King Griffey. I'm like Lionel Richie, my fans have me touring till 2050. This cycle is evil, this verse is for Tino on top of my people. And fuck all these fakers, can't wait till you back on your feet, the streets need you. Up out of the ghetto, away from the mornings with snow in that shovel. Up out of this level, I'm trying to be number one, why would I settle? Gone to the new world, no Pinto, no Nino, no Santa Maria. And I still keep a hood with my peers, sipping Carlos Rossi Sangria. Kells. Alright guys, the next step is going to be painting this yellow. And then we're going to get the jump man. The jump man is going to be blue. But we're going to do the yellow first since blue is darker, it's easier to cover the yellow. And now I know I got it. That's the reason no ID has signed me on a dotted, but it's still. The final installment of this custom is here. My camera batteries died, all three of them, during uh, me painting the lining. So if you want to know, it's just a one run ratio with GAC 900 and the paint you're using. So that's really much it. And now we're just going to be painting the black. And then lastly, I'm doing this bottom blue part right here. Visionary Okay, my fams, here's what you gotta do. To make your soul sauce for your sneakers, you're gonna wanna take the soul sauce of your choosing and blue leather dye. So in here, I have Raleigh Restoration's soul dye, and I'm gonna take my blue leather dye. And this stuff gets everywhere, so I really recommend you don't do it near rug, desk, anything like that. I'm even putting on my blue gloves because if this thing touches your hands, man, your hands will be stained for days. There you go. Pour that bad boy in there. Got a little bit there and stay my glove. Now just mix that puppy mixture around. I think I added too much leather dye. Let me get some more soul sauce in there. I think I added too much soul sauce. Okay, we're good, fam. Whatever. We're just gonna get to the mixture. I mean, guys, I haven't done this too much. I am not an expert in any way of this soul dye mastery. 
but if you feel like following my tutorial, man, then go for it. Okay, fam, the final piece of puzzle. Jeez, I've been working for like hours. Whatever. The final piece of today's puzzle is Raleigh Restorations Scratch Resistant Sealer. This stuff, man, I trust this with my life. Like, I've, I think. The amount of times that oh, see that bubble? Mza, 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 mza. The amount of times that I've put a sneaker through torture because it has this on, like it's uncountable. This stuff works so well. All right, you guys, so thank you so much for watching my custom video on these. These took a total of, like, I want to say, like, 16 hours or so to make. So it was really difficult trying to, for, well, for each shoe, it probably took about 8 hours, and then, so 16 hours total. Uh, it really did take a while, because I had to detail in all the yellow and all that stuff. I had to get the back tab jump in just right. I had to dye the outsoles, like, it's a long process, the recode of black, scratch resistance sealer, all that stuff. You can check out all the products I use down below in the description. And you can check them out. What I use, like shop while you're in just direct here. Raleigh Restorations. Use the code BLAZENDARY for money off your order. You know, just all that stuff. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you please hit that like button if you did enjoy. I'm really trying to get 50,000 subscribers by the end of May. If that could happen, that'd be sweet. Thank you guys for watching. It's BLAZENDARY CAKES. I'm out. Peace.